Um, the themes were chosen as a result of uh, immense collaboration amongst the product team. Uh, it's really hard to come up with 12 images that you feel really um, summarize Canada. So uh, there was lots of discussion, lots of debate, um, and uh, I believe that the 12 that we came up with really are symbolic of what Canada is. One of the things that we're really proud of at the Royal Canadian Mint is we really like to display Canadian talent. Uh, we have a lot of created, creative, talented artists in this vast country of ours, so we try our best to reach out to as many as we possibly can. So therein lies one of the biggest challenges of this series, because there were different artists for each theme. Um, so then the question becomes, how do you then make it look like a set or a series when every artist has a different style, um, a different way of producing their art? In order to make the set look like a set, you think of something that's common. So obviously the main image is not going to be common. One's an iconic polar bear um, or a grizzly bear or beaver. So the concept that we came up with then was a border. So to anchor the whole series, we have Canada, and then we have the denomination on the bottom. And then we used something unique, uh, which was an icon. So an icon that represented the image that we were trying to portray. Uh, paw prints for the animals, and then other symbols for the non-animals. So uh, for Niagara Falls, obviously it's the shooting falls that everybody identifies with, so we use that as the icon. And then we went a step further and then we used all those icons and we put it on the packaging that goes with the product as well. We've received a great response. Um, customers love it, um, existing customers love it, new customers um, are really jumping on board with this product. And internationally, there's been a lot of recognition for this product as well.